Hey, what's up guys? Um, the Bearded Mato here. Today I'm gonna show you how to fix your loading screen adding add-ons uh, fix. Uh, basically this uh, happened to me yesterday because there was a small hotfix and what happened is I couldn't go past the loading screen. So uh, just so that you know what I'm, I'm trying to say right now, when I went into the game, set play game, <coughs> I got my launcher up, I set it play, and what happened is that my game actually stopped playing on this position. So it didn't it didn't went off of the loading uh, add-ons. So we're gonna close this, close, close, right. I went to the, uh, instinctively I went to the internet, I've been on the internet for a long period of time just to try to fix that, uh, but nothing happened to me, I mean, nothing helped me out. Now, uh, there is a multiple uh, scenarios uh, that I'm going to show that maybe it's going to help you that didn't help me. So for starters, you should play without mods, that's the first thing. Basically, next to the play button, you got the arrow showing down. Try to play without mods. Step two, go to parameters. You will have all parameters. Uh, you will have a number here. And if there it is, clear that number. Go and play without mods. Step three, go to the platform over here. Change it to 30, uh, 32-bit instead of a 42. Uh, 64 bit that's another option that uh, it maybe be screwing up with your uh, with your settings and uh, so armor is basically shitting itself and it's not allowing you to play the game okay let's go to step four uh, step four is that you delete a certain file cache.ch uh, you will go to properties, you will go to local files, uh, you will go to browse local files, which means that it's going to put you in here. You will find the ca uh, cache.ch and you will delete it. You're going to close the file and you're going to verify the integrity of the game files, which means that uh, the... Arma 3 will recognize that it's missing that file and that file was corrupted. I mean, that it it's not there anymore and it's going to start the download and it's going to replace it. Okay, and now finally, the, thing, the only thing that helped me out, thanks to my uh, good buddy, uh, uh, which is FreeForce89, his uh, channel is linked down below as well uh, on Twitch. Uh, we are both Twitch streamers, so if you guys uh, want to check us out, please check us out. Uh, we play mostly, um, pretty much every day. Okay, let's go on. So, what happened to me is, when I verify the integrity of game files, I have noticed that there's uh, zero out of one items complete in my downloads. Uh, it basically didn't start downloading that small file of mine. Uh, afterwards, I deleted the. Uh, afterwards, I deleted the. Give me a second. Afterwards, I deleted the uh, ch, cache ch. So what we did over the team viewer, which is this program over here. Give me a second. Where did I put it? Okay, I'll I'll put a link for the team viewer inside the description as well. Uh, he sent me the ch file. Okay, so I got the file. I went back to browse loading files. I input the ch file since I didn't have it from his computer, but it didn't work. So somehow we managed to understand that the biggest problem is actually the battle eye. Uh, and that was the thing that it didn't work for me, which is the sixth thing on the list and the final thing. I hope that's it for you, because past this, I don't know how to help you. Uh, the thing is that I deleted the battle eye uh, 
and the battle line exe. Uh, so basically, I deleted the battle line, and he sent me the battle line over the team viewer, and I reinstalled it inside because somehow my launcher didn't want to download it, re-download it, and put it into my file. So that's basically it. I really hope this uh, this small video will help you. Uh, if it does, show your love, sub, maybe check out my Twitch, check out uh, Free Forces Twitch, and that's basically it. Uh, have a good one. I hope you enjoy uh, Armor for uh, a lot more, and see you in the next one.